been gone i've been gone for a minute and a day and a month and a week and some days but i'm back um i have been really lazy i got sick and i've been working on a lot of other stuff so this is kind of taking a back seat you know and i'm just trying to it's a lot of great things happening behind the scenes so that's kind of been like you know whatever girl so anyway this is for this hair that i'm wearing right now which is from ali grace on aliexpress and this is their deep wave okay now i know you're gonna be like okay so why your hair look like it's curly my point exactly so i'm gonna back up off the chair and i'm gonna show you guys the one basic issue i have with this hair and this is it and it's that my frontal is curly and my hair is a deep wave. So you see how this is, is the deep wave, right? Okay, so if you guys watch my tutorial for this and how I defined these curls and washed and that whole thing, then you would have seen that I did say in that like the, the textures don't match at all. So this doesn't really give you a true depiction of what the deep wave looks like because of the fact that it's curly into a deep wave. And I don't know why this was done. I don't know if they did this on accident. I don't know. But it definitely is two different textures. So this what happens is when you have situations like this that happen, what you're kind of forced to do is wear it in like up styles where you can't tell or you're trying to change the texture of it or maybe let it air dry and pull it. Like I didn't want to do that. I just used water in my tutorial. I didn't use anything in it because I diffused it but because this I didn't diffuse. I used this which is the Magic Hair Company. This is the uh, hydrating curl definer and amplifier. And I use this on my hair and that was it. And of course water. And that's pretty much all I've used in it since I've had it. I haven't put anything so it's just been this and water and this is the look that I've been getting but I do like it like you see they almost match then you get further down and it just starts becoming these big ringlet you know waves as opposed to these as far as the maintenance goes with this you that a lot of that was explained in the tutorial for this because you seen like that was when I first got the hair and I just first made the wig or whatever so you kind of seen how everything has been going but since then if you already watched that and you're watching this since then I've gotten very minimal shedding which is very surprising due to the simple fact that I did cut my webs and I didn't hot glue gun this unit, I actually sewed this one. So it's been a little bit different, which I was shocked by. And as far as the actual curls go, I do high, I do use the amplifier and then I, use, I do, when I did condition, I use my um, Tresemme. So a lot of you guys were asking me like, how do you take care of your curly hair or your wavy hair when, you know, so it can stay looking like this as you wear it. And that's the key. Uh, co-wash at least one to two times a week. I mean at least two to three times a week. I'm sorry and Make sure that you use good products and you can be completely fine and your hair will look like this probably is as long as it's gonna actually last you I've had this hair for months at this point. It's been about five months since I've had like cuz that tutorial was done when I, this was pink originally, <laughs> I've been through about four colors and came back to the pink. Uh, but the company was just like, not right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. They went on vacation and that whole thing. So it's been kind of a hold up. And then it's also due to me, my, myself as well. So yeah. But I haven't had any major issues. The only, my only gripe with this hair is the fact that they gave me two separate textures. And you can obviously tell. Now when I'm in public... I usually wear it where I would drench it in water and then wear it because it's easier that way. But like actually trying to run my fingers through it and stuff, I don't get none of those tangles and I haven't got any since I've received this hair. So I haven't had this issue and then my sister wanted this after she seen mine, but she ended up getting their curly hair, which is this and not this. And I did her a whole curly unit, a unit very similar to this and it was, it's, 
she's been wearing it and she's no she's she's definitely no no hair connoisseur and she hasn't had any issues and i know when it's bad because when she complains she will deal with anything but she was like no i haven't had no problems so i was like okay good they good in my book finally they good in my book the only thing is this don't match buddy as far as my frontal goes it actually looks very natural i did have to plug it as you can see there is in that uh tutorial video there is a section about plucking as well and as you can see i plucked all of this and yeah it's good like i can go ahead and part it i can move it and be really good i tend to pluck my hair when i do my units i tend to pluck them on the more on the sides that i'm gonna wear it on and usually i wear my part on this side so i just okay i just wanted to say it looked a little bald on camera because i have the lightest most like caucasian stocking cap i could find because i am out of all my like brown stocking caps so don't worry i promise you it looks really good in person but on camera i was like oh girl i didn't go over crazy plucking okay you'll see in the tutorial decided to change it to this side just so that it could look more natural and it's not so predictable because you guys know if I could wear a side part for the rest of my life every day I would do it but I can't because it gets boring after a while so with this I wanted to give y'all some flexibility uh, I know somebody's gonna ask right now is my hair wet it is not wet it's completely dry like completely like some water was gonna come out it's dry it's nothing in it at all but it's still soft and that's because i mixed the conditioner after i put the amplifier on it i put the conditioner and water put it in the spray but i actually still use my um my beyond the zone uh, heat protecting bottles when they i use all of the the orange stuff out of it put those in the bottle spray it and then i'll be good you just guys just make sure you keep your hair hydrated. I can't say it. Like, I'm so sick of saying this because I see all too often where I'll see girls be like, oh, I did this to the hair. Like, bleaching this hair is a no-go. Do not do it, okay? I did a strand test and it was not okay. So, if you're thinking about color, this ain't the hair for you. I'm just being honest. This is not the hair for you. So, yeah, when I see people be like, oh, I tried to bleach it and then it, it, it turned into a mop, it turned into a mat, don't, don't not do it every hair that you buy especially when it's expensive should be able to bleach if you're getting this hair at a very aliexpress price if you know what i'm talking about then you have to understand you can't do everything with this hair and this is a beautiful pattern it's, i just wish they matched they don't but don't bleach it if you want to wear it like this wear it like this just don't bleach it okay because i'm gonna tell you it's not gonna be a, a, a great situation like it's just really not i am rocking i believe i'm rocking i'm rocking 220 224s 222s and i'm rocking a 20 inch frontal and this the frontal is a 13 by 4 so i wish it was longer i wish my part went all the way back here but it doesn't unfortunately but you guys know i do like curly hair this is usually the hair when i'm not testing out here that i wear the most often just because it's the most effortless it's very easy and to the point so if i have to give this a grade from one to ten i would give it a seven and a half just because the pattern definitely took a lot of points off for me because I'm so like mad about this like I know it's supposed to be deep wave but this is definitely deep wave curly <laughs> and that's not a look that's not a texture deep wave curly is not a texture so again both of them they they blend fine if you don't care but it looks like I have been wearing my real hair this is what it looked like y'all it looked like I have my real hair and a beehive or some braids and then down here i've been just flat ironing my weave and i wanted to wear curly again so i took my real hair out and then left my tracks in the back that's what i'm looking like that ain't hot because i have a video where my hair i have a red shirt a red coca-cola sweater on and it's a red background i'm doing a little kim song and my hair looks very similar to this my eyes are like blue or green or something and i got these big hoops on and that hair was so uniformed and i i still have that wig to this day it was so uniformed and i didn't get i, I was like oh it's gonna be like that i'm gonna have two of those no. that's not what i got so yeah, Ali Grace, I'm gonna need y'all to start sending out hair that matches, cause as you can see, 
it's all of this and I can't. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will catch you guys in my next one. If you guys are looking for the tutorial for this video, it will be listed below and as well as on my channel or somewhere up here, okay? YouTube got all these features now, girl, so something gonna pop up in a minute and let y'all know what it do, boo. All right, I will catch y'all in my next one.